Hello guys, here we are for another FU money and the update of Bitcoin price. Uh, today I believe this will be a shorter video because you know nothing really uh, different from yesterday um, is happening. Uh, so let's go to the chart. Okay, so as you remember from yesterday's update, um, this third range boundary here was invalidated. So basically the indicator is pointing now to a new third range boundary. We still don't know where this is going to be, but yesterday when I created the, the video, this was uh, the place where the third range boundary was, and I believed it would remain like that for some time. Now we just have to move it a bit up just to be aligned with the new price that today is the chart is showing today. So uh, what's happening here? So as I told you yesterday, I'm expecting a retracement from the third range boundary to the downside. Uh, to the downside, so we have the pro momentum indicator here. Uh, indicator is indicating a bearish configuration. So as you can see, the background is red. We are approaching a uh, really high price according to the uh, the momentum and the sine wave. So the background is red, indicating that this could reverse at any time soon. Um, so basically, I'm just going to leave the third range boundary for now there. So Bitcoin price is breaking 57,000 at this moment in time. It's getting really extended according to the trending channel here and the context channel is getting really close to the price. So I'm expecting a retracement from some place around here where we are right now, just maybe a bit above this price. So let's drop the fibs here and see what happens. Okay, so here to here. So there you go. So the price is now just getting above the red area. So this is actually a very good interest area. So the indicator is giving you a bear signal down here we have the red background the sine wave is going up the momentum is going up a bit but just notice how close we are to the overbought signal so i'm getting signals everywhere that this is an interest area the price could reverse what you do with this information is up to you of course um as a trader, I consider this is now in the interest area for taking some profit, uh, expecting, of course, that the price will reverse for some time. So what could happen from here? Uh, really simple. So as long as you have the fibs here with the red and the green area of interest, you know already that we are leaving the dump zone. So the dump zone is precisely in between the green and the red. Uh, being the worst part of the dump zone, the middle, of course. So we are now entering an area of interest. So this is as a speculative area. This could be a really nice uh, um, area for you to take some profit if you believe that the price, which I also believe that the price is going to have at least some retracement here, possibly forming a fourth range boundary. So let's mark uh, our scenarios. <coughs> so as I told you yesterday, what can really happen, which is the scenario that uh, shows complete irrationality from the market right now, is if you just... Sorry, wrong button. So if you see the market going up from here. This is the more irrational scenario that I believe will not happen for now. Uh, there is another 
a scenario that you can have the price coming down from here, finding some support in previous levels of support, and then coming back down. This would be another possible scenario, which I believe still can happen. I'm now ready to start abandoning the idea that the price could go to 40k as before because the third range boundary is getting really extended to the upside so the more the third range boundary extends to the upside the less chance you have to have a fourth range boundary below the second range boundary so i guess the previous uh, cherry on top area is becoming less and less probable uh, and if this is the case uh, I'm starting to believe that we are not going to see prices below 40k so soon or even between 40k and 42k. So I guess my probable area of interest would be from here, the previous, uh, the previous support to... 47 to 45 something like this this would be a nice area of interest actually 44 to 47 so this would be an area of interest a nice a nice speculative area for a fourth range boundary of course the last one what's happening here oh okay so this would be an area of interest sorry for that uh, let me just put this like uh, here, yellow, and yellow. So this would be my next area of interest uh, if the price really goes down as expected for a fourth range boundary. Of course, the other scenario is the dump zone scenario where the price just retraces and starts to tr to starts to go sideways. We discussed this yesterday. This is the scenario you don't want to see because then it's just, you know, something like that before. Of course, we are in a bull market, so uh, I expect even if you, if you see the price going sideways inside the dump zone for some time, I expect it to break the fibs the red fibs again and continue to the upside because the the market is uh, a bull a very 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 bull market right now so of course this retracement would be the nice one to have uh, the speculative area to entry points here for longs here i'm not doing anything if we are inside the dump zone i'm not trading bitcoin for now this one is really hard uh, to follow because it's you know when you have to follow a breakout like this and like an irrational breakout because someone bought two billion Bitcoin or two billion dollars in Bitcoin or something like that so it's really hard to follow you never know where this is going to end so the most uh, rational scenario the one I'm expecting to see which would be really nice would be to have a uh, retracement for a fourth range boundary around here and then from there you can have your entry points and then wait again for the start of a new trend so again just to sum it up the momentum indicator is giving you red signs uh, everywhere the background is red you have a bear signal here sine wave in red also signal okay uh, so I, I am expecting I would I would give like the scenario for the 40k which is down here around this area I would not give it more than five ten percent chances right now I would give this one for the fourth range boundary above the second range boundary I would give this scenario a lot more probabilities than the one for the 40k this one if it happens I'm not trading this one if it happens is really hard to catch so be careful out there and i hope you have safe trades oh by the way some people just um, let me just stop the screen share here some people just gave me some feedback that i should change the background here 
on my videos. Of course, I'm already, I was already expecting that. I have an order for a green uh, chroma key, um, you know, cloth just to put behind me so we can have nice, uh, nice uh, videos or even images uh, just uh, behind uh, my back. So I hope to get it next week. It will be soon enough. I guess uh, so till then you have to <laughs> you have to see my stairs um, behind me and then I hope we can change that in the future in future videos so that's it um, so my analysis is ready for today um, just a short update because not really big changes so I hope to I hope you enjoyed this uh, short update and we'll see you on the next one Bye.